Me and Carl, we're thinking of trying to make a bracelet, but we don't, have, we don't know how we're going to make that. Hey everyone, Team Sorcerers here, yeah, and I am finally opening up my Battles of Legend 4 boxes after... Finally, you let one off. So yeah, as you can probably hear, I've got Express Gaming and Gamer Central on Skype, who are here to bear witness, kind of, in a way. Um, I also got these. Um, a legendary duelist one box and some OTS packs as an as a as an apology for it being late. Um, and um, uh, as you can see, I've got numbers one and two, the ones from the loose packs, um, just here for good luck, as well as these Japanese copies of number eighty nine and. Diabolosis the Mind Hacker, and it looks like this one's a collector's rare, which is surprising. I didn't even know that until I got it. Um, so yeah, they're gonna be my good luck charms. Um, so yeah, we, whoops, it fell over. There we are. Um, I can just gets that back into position. Well, that's what she said. <laughs> there we are. So we all know the drill here. Finish the number hunt once and for all. Um, hence why I bought Japanese uh, number 89s, because uh, quite frankly I'm not willing to wait any longer than I have already to finish my number collection and Yuma character deck collection. Um, I'm also hoping to pull a Chimeratech Mega Fleet Dragon for my tunes, because I'm still playing Toon Cyber Dragon in there. But before I open the actual boxes, I'm going to open this extra stuff. <sighs> This is my first OTS 13 pack opening as well. Oh, which ulti old rare is Pink Uh I, Oh, I got Scrap Golem. I believe it's uh, Book of Moon, uh, Abyss Dweller, and Traptrix Reflesia, I think. Mm. What? Oh, no, don't tell me. So I got this and I pulled an ultimate rare book of moon. Oh, yeah, you're not kidding. <laughs> Well, that's the first time I've actually pulled an ultimate rare from an OTS pack. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going to sleeve that up right away. Um, this is a big moment because it, out of all the OTS packs I've pulled when I got them in tournaments, I've never pulled an ultimate rare until now. I've got some decent supers, but no ulti. I've got a Gene Raid token out of that one. Yeah, these packs were definitely a token of appreciation. <laughs> a lady in white and ABC Dragon Buster. And last one of this. Oh, 
I thought I had another ulti, but no such luck. I got Bahama Shock. Very nice. Now let's open this up. This, uh, this one is very different from what I opened last week. Here's the promo pack with Ancient Gear Fusion. Uh, from the other one, I did get Bandit Keith, but let's see who I get this time. Ooh, Maximilian Pegasus. Think if there's anything I want from the set. Oh, here's the other Pegasus. Crystal B Sapphire Pegasus to be exact. Oh god, a common black stone of legend. That's crazy. Uh, relinquished. And uh, Ancient Gear Megaton Golem. I swear I got this last time. Toon Table of Contents and Melfi Rabbi. That is cute. I'm a first cat, I actually need that for one of my collections. Uh, Red Eyes Insight, common. Uh, did I... Oh, well, I got another tune table of contents. And Citadel Whale, followed by Curse of Dragon, the Cursed Dragon. Very nice. Right, so now it's time for the main event, the Battles of Legend Armageddon box opening. <laughs> eh. Wow, it does not want to open. <laughs> oh, there we go. I was about to say it doesn't help that I trimmed my nails recently. But you might say when it comes to getting into the box, I nailed it. <laughs> oh, number 89 is kind of out of view here. Just quickly, um... You pulled two two tables of content, didn't you? Yes, I did pull two 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 table of contents. There. Bang <laughs> twister. <laughs> yeah. What colour writing did they add? Uh, this one. They had a couple of different colours. Yeah, this one's blue and this one's purple. Mm. Oh, I kind of saw what the secret was already, that's annoying. Uh, but I got this, this, and Numeron Calling. It's got one of the uh, highly sought after secrets. Um, I guess I'll worry about sleeving them up later. opening packs at this angle. Like, how do Jobber and Cyber Knight do it? Oh, Fire Flint Lady. That's supposed to be really good, apparently. 
and Elemental Hero Escurido. Very nice. oh, definitely a much needed reprint. <clears throat> Although Aeneas was needed more, just saying Konami, just saying, and oh, Numeron Network! Got Numeron Network. <clears throat> nice. I know that's meant to be very valuable. It will be Monday, but I'm sure everyone will want to pick up to do the Utopia's Pectal Clans mess up. It'll be one of the chase cards, I reckon. Yeah. It will go up. Speaking of utopias, I'll have lightning. Well, from what I've heard, it was $40 to start off with, and then it dropped. I'm not sure what that is in pounds. Ooh, my Dolce and Jelly. Uh, I have a funny feeling. Mm -hmm. I feel like Max is going to want this off me. I can't think why. <laughs> I could do a jelly in the belly all the time. I quite fancy some jelly. Hey! Number three, Numeron Gates Trini. Secure Guard up and Time Stream! <clears throat> yes, yes, yes. There we go. Um. Two more of that. No, wait. Yeah, I need one more of these ones here. Shining Flare Wingman, something else that was a much needed reprint because its last printing was in Legendary Collection 2. Because I don't think it was in the raw mega pack. Um, uh, specimen inspection, there we go. Um, so regardless, that was nine years ago now. It's crazy. Yeah, it's nine years ago also when Zeal started, like Seize Monsters came into the game, and uh, the, of course the numbers were introduced. Oh, I almost skipped ahead there, but I got Dark Armed, the Dragon of Annihilation. You're only just gaming one of those. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess you have one now to go in your Dark Magicians if you ever want to play it one day. Yeah, it could do. And Danger Jackalope. <laughs> Probably already mentioned this, but it's kind of interesting how uh, that's in here when we got it in the Megatons last year. Got, ah, the fake number three, Cedar King and Power Crawler. Yeah, the fake one was the one that the insect, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm guessing the years that was the remaining fake numbers. Oh cool, I got another number two. There we go. That, that'll, go. that'll go to Yuma and got Armored White Bear. Yes, number four, there we go. All the numbers for the what did you need with mixed um, I'm now missing uh, another one, another three, and another four. But regardless, the numbers for the number collection are all gathered. Hey, Cloffy. <laughs> uh, Glacial Beast Polar Penguin. All of these will be sleeved up later, but uh, I don't have a lot of sleeves left. 
there we go, another number three, as in the real one, and a fossil warrior skull bone. Hey, another Shining Flare Wingman, and Chaos Neo Now, this is a questionable print, like, this should have been Air Neos. What the hell, Konami? I mean, I'm fine for copies of Air Neos, but, um, yeah, this is just a mini rant for the other people who want to play full power Neospatians. And there's a little bit of an inking error on that one. Oh, well, Neosadius afterwards. That was a mostly a hero pack. Wow. Only one card was not a hero monster. Brotherhood of the Firefist Lion Emperor. <laughs> That's quite funny. Oh, wow, another number two. Um, I think I'm good for number twos now. Uh oh, what did I get? Fossil fusion. Sweet. Speaking of fusions, this looks like a mostly a fusion pack. There we go, number four. And oh, I got the big fossil boss monster, Skull Gyos. Separating the fossils because uh, Darkness Hell 1989 wants to play them. And I'm assuming you pulled pretty much everything from your box opening, right? Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. It's finally, number one. <laughs> there we go. And well, apart from your arm um, dragon. Annihilation, I got the Chaos Emperor Armageddon. Yeah. And the I haven't seen it yet. Another fake number three. And, well, I have a play set of Escarid Owls. No, I still need Chimeratech Mega Fleet. Oh, I got Artifact Sanctum. That's my first one of those. And Fossil I Warrior feel Skull. Like I've been printing with some of Battle Research machines so far. Yeah. Another number one. Oh, first one of Rainstorm I pulled. Invoked Radian and another Numeron Calling. Nice. Uh, so we've got four packs left from box number one. Flint Lady and Angeli. I got Darkness Metal, the Dragon of Dark Steel. Nice. Ooh, that's a bit much missing that, I think. When I was only... Trishler, the only two more jump promos I actually need to get for the collection. Sweet. And this, of course, you plan on that red on your red set. What's that? You kind of chopped out there. <laughs> the red old link monster midget pool. Oh, yeah. Are you planning to play it in red eyes? Uh, not really. Um, so you're welcome to it. In the meantime, I pulled another Numeron network. I mean, I could, but. 
it's not really necessary, so you're welcome to it. Uh, Kokomiri Draco, nice. And Glacial Beast Blizzard Wolf. Be interesting to see if Glacial Beasts take off. Right, that's it for box one. So I've pulled all the numbers from there, as I thought I would. Um, of course, even if I don't get Mega Fleet, not a problem. Uh, Toons don't rely on the extra deck that much anyway. That's the first pack of box number two. Speaking of number twos, uh, oh, and number one right behind it, and Danger Jackalope. Hey, a lion. I uh, haven't pulled that yet. Not from this opening, anyway. Oh, it's a synchro and it's Glacial Beast Iceberg Narwhal. Uh, I need to sit cross legged on my chair. This is getting uncomfortable. Uh. A large pile of litter right over there. Okay. Uh, hey, I got chaos number one. A bit late getting this, considering I picked it up in a trade. Nice. Um. And there's another damn siren. Ooh, steam synchron. Um, I might actually put this in my. <clears throat> I might actually put this in my Stardust Junk deck, just as an alternative level three synchron uh, to special off speeder. Hey! I, I pulled Trishula. Yeah, make it an even more. It will be a structure deck very soon. Oh, yeah, the Ice Barrier structure deck. Well, we didn't wait until next year because Japan gets it in November. High rate draw. Ooh. It very nearly fell over again. Now, will it be possible to get the other two dragons, uh, a Chaos Emperor and Judgment? We shall see. Artifact Ignition. I don't know how I'll react if I pull 10,000 Dragon or the Astral Language Utopia. <laughs> well, if it's a Utopia, pretty much me and you are probably going to be dead silent for the past five minutes. <laughs> However, just in case you don't pull this or yours, I have two. Oh, nice one. So obviously, I'm going to keep one, but I'll. He gladly give you one. That's what she said. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, number F0, Utopic Future Slash. First one of him I've pulled. Yeah. Hey, Book of Moon. And wow, is that a did I pull a play set of Numeron calling? Let's have a look. Oh yeah, I did. <laughs> That's quite funny. Skull Knight. Um, I think that's meant to be the most valuable fossil card. Shining Flare Wingman again, that's my playset. <laughs> Another specimen inspection. That's what it was. Glacial Beast. A blizzard Wolf accidentally spoiled it. Right, we're almost half an hour in. Wow. Armored White Bear. Regeneration. Right, just to get everyone ready for that last support in the next legendary duel set. Fire for the lady. Another artifact ignition. Uh, let's see how many packs have I got left. Six packs left. Uh, number C92 Heart Earth Dragon. It seems so random to put that in there. Especially considering the original form isn't even in there. I'm gonna save this pack for last. Are you serious? A back-to-back -back Heart of Chaos Dragons? <laughs> uh, oh, I kind of spoiled the secret there, but Howard Crawler. Three left of the whole open. Danger Jackalope again. <laughs> if that was still a free, I'd be set. <laughs> another ignition and another sanctum. All right, final pack. Can I please end? With Megafleet, or maybe one of those 
cards that are worth hundreds of pounds. Oh, my second Utopia of the Lightning. Ah, oh, Fossil Warrior Skull King. I saw a fusion and I thought, yes, Chimera Tech. Then, oh. <laughs> Damn, that's really surprising. But there we go. That's the opening. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Uh, I certainly did. Uh, definitely worth the wait. I mean, I knew uh, I could finish uh, the number collection and humour character deck collection. Um, everything else was just a bonus, literally. Um, so yeah, I'm going to tidy all this up now, um, sleeve stuff up, and then I'll probably uh, do that number collection update video. Uh, thank you very much for watching, stay safe out there, and we'll see you later. Bye bye.